फ्रेंड्स इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न व्हाट इज एयर सर्किट ब्रेकर वाई एयर सर्किट ब्रेकर यूज एंड आल्सो लर्न हाउ मेनी कॉइल यूज इन एयर सर्किट ब्रेकर ऑल कॉइल्स इन नेम एंड आल्सो लर्न फंक्शंस ऑफ ऑल कॉइल सो लेट्स स्टार्ट वीडियो एंड फर्स्ट सी ए सी बी कॉइल्स नेम सो फर्स्ट कॉइल इज अंडर वोल्टेज कॉइल और यू वी कॉइल सेकेंड कॉइल इज शंट रिलीज और शंट कॉइल एंड थर्ड कॉइल इज closing release coil or you can say closing coil so in acb we have total three coils okay we will learn all coils function in later of this video so before we start video first to see why air circuit breaker used so as we know mcb used in our house for protection as air circuit breaker used in industry okay mcb rating as we know we can get mcb from 1 ampere to 100 ampere as air circuit breaker rating is 630 ampere to 10000 ampere so air circuit breaker used for industrial purpose and mcb used for house purpose as we know in mcb we have overload protection and also short circuit protection while in air circuit breaker we also get overload protection and short circuit protection and also we have earth fault protection in air circuit breaker and also in scb we have under voltage protection because uv coil are under voltage coil connects in air circuit breaker so we have under voltage protection also in air circuit breaker i hope you clear the concept and now learn why air circuit breaker use so as we know when we connect a supply to load okay and if load amount is high then very high spark is generated there as in mcb if supply connect here and load connect here and if mcb is on because load ampere is low then spark is generate but spark amount is low in mcb okay while in air circuit breaker because air circuit breaker used for industrial purpose and load is very high then if supply connect to the load then very high spark is generate okay so for quench this high spark or reduce this high spark arc chute is connect in air circuit breaker okay because as we know in air circuit breaker make and break process done at very high amount of current okay now this by this make and break process very high spark is generate so arc should provide external medium external air medium okay to quench or reduce this high spark okay so arc chute is basically connect to reduce high spark or quench high spark while in mcb and mccb arc chute is not required okay now see air circuit breakers coils name and function so first coil is under voltage coil you can see the structure of this under voltage coil is here under voltage coil may be operate at 220 volt or may be 440 volt okay so first you need to connect under voltage coil for 440 volt why because under voltage coil main function is providing protection okay so main function is providing protection if any phase is not coming in acb by burnt any fuse in substations are also break any do in substation and if proper voltage not coming in this air circuit breaker then this under voltage coil will trip acb okay so under voltage coil main function to trip breaker if proper voltage is not coming i hope you clear the concept okay and under voltage coil should connect off 440 volt because if any phase not come then this under voltage coil trip air circuit breaker and load will be safe okay so main function of uv coil is providing protection to our load i hope you clear the concept also now second of the coil which is closing release coil or closing voltage coil you can see structure of this closing release coil first this closing release coil only in edo breaker electrically draw out breaker okay so closing release coil only connect in edo breaker so main function of this closing release coil to remotely start air circuit breaker okay if you want to start your is air circuit breaker by providing any of the command from plc or any tnc switch trip neutral switch okay so if you want to start your air circuit breaker remotely from any of the place okay you can see it is tnc switch if you close 
this TNC switch your air circuit breaker will start okay so main function of closing release coil to remotely start okay you, you this command can be provided by any PLC or any of the switch so main function of this closing release coil to remotely start air circuit breaker if voltage comes in this closing release coil then your air circuit breaker will start okay so main function of closing release coil to remotely start now next coil is shunt release coil okay so shunt release coil structure is here and main function of this shunt release coil to remotely trip air circuit breaker you can see we have two switch this switch is used for locally start and stop okay and if you want to trip your air circuit breaker remotely okay from any other place so you need to connect a shunt release coil by shunt release coil you can trip your air circuit breaker remotely from any other place okay so i hope you clear the concept now if you want to give answer in one word so first is under voltage coil under voltage coil main function for provide protection if proper voltage not come then air circuit breaker will trip now second coil is closing release coil which is used for start remotely of your breaker so for remotely start closing release coil is used and shunt release coil so shunt release coil main function is remotely trip okay so shunt release coil used for remotely trip of air circuit breaker so i hope you clear the concept why air circuit breaker used and how many coils used in air circuit breakers all coils name and function for today's enough we'll meet in next video